Hey guys, Blue Saber here, and welcome to my Evolve Life Found A Way achievement guide. Basically, this is one of the new achievements that were added after the arena was added. For this, I thought that going the Wraith with the level 3 decoy and level 3 warp blast was a good idea, because I was mostly going to be hunting and running away like a coward. A behemoth's always also good if you use the rock wall effectively, but honestly, I'm not going to... You don't need everything perfect to do this. You can do it in an online match. You can do it against bots like I'm doing. It's pretty easy, really pick the you could pick the hunters I decided to go with basically anyone who is just not gonna pose that much of a threat in those circumstances Hank for example it can only all but bombard me every so often and if I'm in a cave area or indoors he can't use it I went for Griffin because main reason being his harpoon is shit against the Wraith because the Wraith's melee is incredibly fast Honestly, it don't make a massive difference between the assault, but I'd probably say don't pick Torvad because he's an ass who does shit tons of damage. Yeah, you, you Viking prick. Right. Honestly, you could probably stick with Laz, to be honest, just because he can revive his teammates. You could use that to your advantage if you're just looking for this achievement alone. This achievement basically requires you to evolve to stage level 3, which you're already at 2, but you need to evolve to stage 3. I think in an online fight, this is honestly impractical. Because you should probably win at stage 2. Shouldn't make that big of a difference. But basically, you're going to wander around, you're going to just find creatures to eat. And that's all I'm going to do. You could pick a specific map that you like, but... To be honest, I'm going to show you that you can't. You don't always need to have everything on your side. Like, this isn't the best map. This may not be the best selection of hunters. And honestly, I could have put population on high if you go into a custom game, so basically the wildlife's on your side where you'll find loads of them. It's all look a bit like hunting in the real game. I went warp blast, like I said, to basically help me with hunting. I went decoy to eat the creatures while that decoy's doing some damage. My main priority is not killing the hunters here, it's just running around, getting the animals, evolving up. And really, that's it. It's a pretty simple achievement, especially if you do it against bots. Like, I've had a match or two online where I could have done it, I could have evolved in a match if I wanted to, but, like I said, it's impractical. I mean, unless you're really, really defensive, but it's just a waste of time. The arena's too small. Easy enough, the decoys just keep distracting the guys from me while I feed, while they don't shoot me for shit, because they're idiots. The Reeves rock wall will also work, but... I find the behemoths more difficult to use, and the rock wall's only good if you get some serious distance before using it. Use it at point blank, and it barely covers any terrain. Or just flat out doesn't, leaves a gap in it for some strange reason that I don't get. Like I said, this may not be the best map for this, but to be honest, you'll get you'll pick a map, and you'll get a random dome anyway within that map. So there'll be some good environments, there'll be some bad environments. If these were players, I'd be fucked, because they'd be just run over at mountain, or we'll go over at rock and basically get me from above, but... Further oh, bots. That's why this achievement's easier. I'll keep dashing around until you evolve up. Why not? And really, this is it. You just gotta hope you get some wildlife popping in and out and getting some kills. If not, then you're basically gonna have to fight. You could have picked even Lazarus or Val, I reckon, for medics because I think they are the worst medics. Like, Lazarus is good because you can basically, you get evolve points for just downing and killing them. So, letting Laz revive them, and you can get more evolve points for that. Plus, he can't really heal in mid-combat, so he's not much of a threat in a fight anyway. Besides, bots are really predictable when it comes to medics. Bots are predictable anyway, that's the weakness of them. But, as you can see now, I'm running out of wildlife. I really haven't found any for about a minute, so I'm really debating... I need to fight. I'm thinking, I need to fight, I need to down some guys, but I need to be careful not to kill the whole team because that'll count as a win. So I need to get in there, do some damage. If you think you're going to get into this scenario, then you could probably pick Supernova. But I, you, I can do Warp Blast or Supernova, I'm not really fussed. I could have gone level 2 if you're going to go solely hunting, but I usually don't go level... If, I, if I'm going to fight, I don't go level 1. Something like Abduct or Tongue Grab's good for level 1, but nothing else is. That's me anyway. Done. There's one down. There's one a bit to my evolve meter. I know people are going to go for him. Just try and kill him, basically. Just leave everyone. The medic's going to be super passive, so I can just leave the medic once I've downed everybody else. I can always eat these corpses to get like two more pieces of meat each. And they're not even shooting at me, so this is really handy. 
There we go. Go on, Val, keep healing you, bitch. Val is so crap, even after the buffter. Jesus Christ. Ky Kyra could have been healing them both. And she could have been doing more than Val doing right now. But... Oh well. Just decoy up, or just don't get shot, because the AI don't want to shoot me. So here I decided I've only got one person left, and I have to one off, I have to get a bit of wildlife. Like I said, I could have put a population on the high and made this easier, but just to demonstrate, you can do this even when you haven't got the best conditions possible. Just to eat up and evolve. Easy enough. Like I say, it's pretty impractical doing it in, in a game, but what the hell. You want to do it before the timer runs out as well. I'm not quite sure what a sudden death timer does, but if you spend too long doing it, it'll count as a draw. And there's your life finds a way achievement. Pretty simple, really. Best used on solo, you can do it on multiplayer. Anyway, I hope this helped, hope you enjoyed, and if you want to see my first match in the arena, I'm going to be uploading that shortly after this. It's with my mate, and I'm apologising right now if the audio shit, I need to get a good party set up or something. Preferably a better Turtle Beach set. Anyway guys, I'll see you later.